Hi uh, friends, uh, here is another problem in corner geometry. It's uh, especially related to a distance formula. Question is saying find a point on x axis which is equidistant from the points a2, comma minus 5 and b minus 2, comma 9. Okay. So let uh, here let me make a rough diagram, right? Okay. Suppose this is my x axis and this is y axis. Uh, this is my origin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, like. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, okay? And 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, like this, okay? <coughs> I'm sorry. So, here, it's 2 minus 5 first, right? 1, 2, it's 2 and minus 5. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, okay, I have to go further more 1 here. Like this, here will be a point, right? It's called A, 2 minus 5. And another is b minus 2 9 right so b minus 2 9 okay fine 1 2 minus 2 right 9 and 9 is the topmost right here so this is a point b now we have to find a such a point right in x-axis which is equidistance from this point a and the b right let let's suppose point p is equidistance from b and a okay it means this and this means this and this will be equal right equidistance from the b and a so let's uh, suppose the ordinate of this coordinates of this p points b x along x axis so let's suppose it is x right and since along y axis it is not moving neither upside neither downstairs so the see neither moving upside now neither moving downstairs right so it will be only x zero okay so now uh, let's uh, find out the value of this x okay or the value of the point so here according to the question p a is equals to p b right means the distance of this p a is equals to distance of p b okay and the value of b we know that's minus 2 9 right so now let's find out the distance p b and the p a okay or for the p a again x2 minus x1 so let's suppose this is x2 right L let's suppose this as x2 y2 and as x1 y1 this and this also okay so let's find out first pa pa equals to x minus 2 whole square plus 0 minus minus 5 whole square right but it's root over again pb right so pb x minus since here is a minus so it will be minus 2 whole square plus 0 minus 9 whole square I think you are getting me what I'm ex uh, exactly over uh, here I'm utilizing I'm utilizing the distance formula right the distance formula d equals to x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square okay actually I'm using this formula over here right I just find out the distance pb and the pa over here right now uh, let's do this let's solve this right x2 minus x1 right so x minus 2 whole square again minus minus plus so it will be 5 square root over and here x c minus minus plus so it will be x plus 2 whole square and c 0 minus 9 it will be minus minus 9 whole square it will be only 9 whole square right now let's square both side right squaring both side squaring both side what we'll get we'll get x minus 2 whole square plus 25 is equals to x plus 2 whole square plus 81 right so let me use the formula here uh, as we have already learned in previous classes right that is uh, simply a minus b whole square equals to a square minus 2ab plus b square and another formula a plus b whole square is equals to a square plus 2ab plus b square okay so I'm using this 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 two formula over here right simply see a minus b so a minus b it means a square minus 2ab plus b square again 25 right equals to again 
a plus b right a plus b whole square a square that is a square plus 2 a b plus b square again 81 so see here both side x square and this x square get cancelled right and again here plus 2 square that is 4 and again here plus 2 square that is 4 it gets cut down right or you can say minus see 2 to the 4x plus 25 2 to the 4 again here see 4x plus 81 so I'm just taking this side uh, this minus 4x right in this side so it will be uh, this 25 minus 81 right equals to 8x simply you can say or now when you subtract uh, 25 from uh, 81 right let me subtract over here so it will be 11 minus 5 6 right and it will be 7 7 minus 2 it will be 5 right so it will be 56 right so let me write here it is 56 but it will be negative right because since bigger is subtracted from the smaller so again 8a 8x okay therefore x will be minus 56 divided by 8 that is 8 7 the 56 so the value of x is minus 7 and the required point uh, that required point p is minus 7 0 so the value of this point is minus 7 0 like this we have to solve the problem okay bye bye we'll be uh, meeting in next video with lots of example right bye bye